Hi, welcome to this week's edition of My Legacy Attorney Monday Question and Answer video. This week's question is, what should you do if the original will is lost or destroyed and you only have a copy? Now in my video I did a couple of weeks ago on where to store a will, I mentioned that I would do a video on what to do if you find yourself in a situation where a loved one has passed and you can't locate the original will or it was destroyed in, for example, a fire. So here I'll describe what you can do if you only have a copy. Now please, please understand that you'll be fighting an uphill battle as most courts will presume a lost will to be revoked. Now there are five things that must be true or you must prove in order to attempt to validate the copy. First, the person who the will was drafted for known as the testator, has to be deceased, otherwise they can simply create another will. Secondly, the testator actually created and executed the will and the document fulfills your state's requirement of a valid will. Third, the contents and substance of the will has to be valid. Fourth, a diligent search has been conducted to locate the original will. And fifth, the testator did not revoke or destroy the original copy. Now, you will need to present as much proof as you can to a probate court about why you believe the copy is valid. You can have witnesses testify about what they know, even about what the testator told them about the will. You can present other documents, email, video, etc., or any other proof that goes to the validity of the copy and that the original wasn't destroyed or revoked. I hope that you're not going through or having to go through this process. Now, if you want to learn how to keep your loved ones out of court and out of conflict, even if your will is lost or destroyed, please contact me, norman at normthompsonlaw.com. Thank you.